Hello everyone. My name is Smriti. Today I am back again on our channel to explain you about force.com. As I already told you in my previous channel that force.com is a type of a platform which provides platform as a service part of Salesforce. So what is force.com? Force.com is a type of a platform only which enables developers to create and deliver any kind of business application without using any software. Okay. So force.com, if I'll tell you in some simple terms, it enables developers to create or deliver any type of application I can say. You can say it as any business applications without any software or anything but force.com in simple term is this. Now this platform also include you know, easy to use point and click customization. So this is a type of a customization where we, you are just clicking or using point uh, things on any tool, which helps you to create solution for any business requirement. So, and this is happening, you know, without any programming experience. So this platform, another feature I can tell you is, it uses point and click customization. Okay. To create any solution. Sorry. And this solution can be pertaining to any business requirement and also without having any knowledge of any programming language. Okay, so some basic points I can give you about this platform. Also, this is some additional thing which I can provide you is like Salesforce company provides this uh, force.com platform. provides this platform which is called as force.com okay okay another additional feature i can tell you is like you know by using this platform we can create different different cloud applications as well as salesforce application so we can use these this to create any cloud applications or Salesforce applications. Okay. So next additional thing which I can tell you about this platform is like, you know, we can use the Apex as well as visual programming languages for any type of development in the cloud. So Apex and visual pro programming language. Can be used for development using this. Okay. Uh, next, next thing I can tell you is like, yeah, so this is provided by salesforce.com and it is provided on the basis of rental basis. Like I can see that on rent, we can uh, take this thing and this has been provided to us by salesforce.com on the basis of rent. So I can write it as salesforce.com. 
dot com uh, uh, provide this on provide this on rental basis. Okay. Next thing which I can think is like, uh, yeah. So using this platform, you have to build your own applications. So. these are not you know already applications which you can get automatically you have to build your own application using this so you have to build your own applications using this this is another feature of force.com okay so next thing which i can explain you about this is uh okay here let me explain so now some typical use cases or i can say you know platform typical use cases i can give you is let me make the font size bigger okay so platform typical use cases if i'll tell you like where are these things getting used so first of all i can think you of feature is like it you know enable employee to access you know corporate data from anywhere if he is anywhere he can access that corporate data if he is an employee of uh, you know this platform so enable employee to access uh corporate data or any type of data from anywhere okay next thing next type of use cases for this platform is like it you know it uh, creates an interaction between any employee or an employee so it creates a connection for employee and employer okay okay so next cases i can consider is like the other use case the last use case which i can think of right now is uh, the basic thing or i can say the most important thing which uh, which we can see in our uh, which we can figure out in our daily lives as well that it creates the mobile applications okay which obviously what is happening like through mobile apps what is happening that it has somehow in the some way or the other it has increased the employee productivity okay so it creates mobile apps which has led to i can say um employee productivity okay okay so so guys that's all about the force.com next we will be moving to salesforce as well as to crm introduction and i will be explaining you about that in my next session so please let me know if you have any doubt regarding this things which we have discussed today today we have covered as a short summary i would like to tell you that today we have covered about what is the force.com and what is the features of the platform we are using okay and obviously the typical use cases which we are using as a part of force.com so if you like my video please share comment and like the video and do come back on my next chan uh, next video of the channel and stay tuned i will be back again with my new knowledge with explaining you about the next session thank you so much bye bye